Romalia Senki is the latest light novel series that is being made into an anime. An anime adaptation is in the works for the Romalia Senki Mao Wo Toshita Atomo Jinryu Yabaso Dakara Gunta Shoshiki Shita novels as revealed with the release of the latest volume of the manga adaptation. The series written by Ryo Ariyama and illustrated by Ryo Kamato has also surpassed 400,000 copies in circulation. So Magco is holding a lottery for autographed copies of the latest volume to celebrate. That's good news for the people that actually read this light novel series. And since there is the word Mao, could mean demon lord. So there might be a little bit of magic in this anime. Yeah, it gets me excited. Another could be fantasy light novel series that is being made into an anime. I do love this. Keep giving us more and more and more fantasy magic animes i love these i really really do love these i don't read the books those who have the courage to read books or continue to read books you're the reason why some of these animes get made especially all these popular isekai banished genre fantasy anime you're the reason why these animes are created because you make them popular so keep buying them and keep reading them i'm not going to read them but you guys keep reading them. Further details about the anime adaptation have yet to be announced. So there is like no like video because sometimes they do announce it through a video. But this time they announced it through their latest manga. Which now we know now they have a manga. So I maybe actually look into this manga and see how good it would be. And it will maybe tell me how good the anime would be. But to me... Just by seeing the word Mao, I'm already already interested. There's no trailer yet. It just got announced that it is coming out. I would love to actually see the trailer in order to actually give an actual input into if I'm actually going to watch this anime. But just the word Mao just convinces me to actually watch this anime. Just that word alone. Any anime that has that word, Mao, which would mean Demon Lord, is a, it's a winning for me. Like, that's a yes for me to actually watch the anime. But, uh, since there is no release date, no other information about this anime that's happening, no trailer, no teaser, no opening song, but the closer we get to that release date, the more information we're going to get. So, I say check in around three four months maybe you'll get more information a teaser trailer most likely it'll probably be around say spring 2025 or summer 2025 or a possible fall 2025 but who knows here's the visual art that they gave us or i think this is a cover art for one of the volumes of the light novel series this will be the main character of this series as you can see more of a tomboy type of character but it is a female you can see the bust line you can see the waist as that womanly figure so it's, i would assume that the woman would be the demon lord but then they have her dressed up as like in two different outfits could be that it could be twins who knows like i said there's not a lot of information out there so yeah that's this is the like the closest we'll get of what it will look like for right now. Featuring character designs by Kodama, Romalia Senki started as a web novel before being published via the Gaga Gaga Bunko imprint with illustration by Ryo Kamato, who also handles the manga adaptation art. The manga is available, available via Mag Gardens mag com i site or my kami site sorry the story follows romalia who prince fiance 
breaks off their engagement after the defeat of the Demon King. Romalia's homeland remains infested with the Demon King's forces, so now it's up to her to return, raise an army, and march into battle with her unique power of luck at her side. Okay, so <laughs> that's a pretty cool power to have. The unique power of luck. Wow. What a bad prince, though. What a bad fiancé to actually break off after he actually accomplished his goal, I guess. I guess he maybe fell in, fall in love with somebody else after that. Maybe he used her as a way to gain power or something like that. Basically, somebody who should never, ever, ever, ever be near her again. Somebody who should never be called a hero again. Even though he did defeat the Demon King, now he left her alone to deal with the remnants of the Demon King's army. He didn't slaughter the entire Demon army, he just slaughtered the Demon King. So I can see why, why now they call it, or why now they say Mao. So it's not a, like she's going after the Demon King, the Demon King's gone, it just now she's gonna have to deal with the army itself. Hopefully she wins and hopefully she finds somebody who suits her. Hopefully somebody that matches her energy, matches her and doesn't actually leave her. Hopefully. Who knows? This is uh, this is some good information right here. I would say if you don't actually read the book, then this is some good information. I would suggest actually reading the manga to get even more information so that you don't have to wait for the information to come out. But this is some good information right here. Yeah. Whenever that guy, which eventually will happen, usually does happen. It's another thing. Like it's the same type of feeling. Like when somebody leaves a party or somebody gets kicked out of the party, like that same feeling for those banished anime that we get to see all the time or sometimes throughout the year. It's that same type of feeling where, she basically, he basically left her. <laughs> a prince. Not princely either. You know what, they should revoke that title, <laughs> right? Why not, right? Revoke that title. So I think that, like, she was the post, she's the one that actually slain the Demon King, and then he just decided to leave. Uh, so yeah, it could have been her victory, and then, you know what, that, or his victory, who knows. We need more details, that's the thing. More details, but I just, I'm hoping that the guy does come back and gives him a good punch, but who knows. Let us know what your thoughts are in the comments down below. If you have any thoughts, if you have read this book, please do comment in the comment section down below. And I hope to see you on the next video. Peace out.